conditions and treatments community expert on WebMD. Let's welcome to our show Harvard-trained dermatologist, Dr. Susan Evans, a doctor, a mom, you're doing it all, and you're here to talk to us about antioxidants. I am. Antioxidants are a great thing that everybody should have in their program. There's a lot of buzz about them. Yeah. Are they just a fad, or why are they so important? It's very important. It's documented that free radical formation from oxidation in our cells causes cell death and premature aging, and in some cases can contribute to cancer. Antioxidants can stop that, and it makes a difference. Tell me exactly what free radicals are, because it just scares me the name. <laughs> it, it should scare you. It's a natural process. When our body metabolizes oxygen, it makes a waste product, and that waste product is free radicals. They're unstable. They bind with our DNA. They do things in the cell to cause cell death and can cause different conditions like cancer and diabetes. But help, come to the rescue, antioxidants in the form of all sorts of wonderful things that we love. Fruit. Absolutely. You want a rich force, source of antioxidants in your system so that they can scavenge those free radicals and keep them from causing damages in your body and these disease processes. This is easy. Berries and papaya and strawberries. Exactly. I'm signing up. Papaya is great to eat. It's rich in antioxidants. It has all sorts of vitamins. It's great for you and it tastes good. And these other berries are really rich blueberry, especially in antioxidants. And it's a wonderful thing to put into your program. Now, if if you are one of those people that is trying to uh, do all of this but don't have a lot of time and don't have a papaya tree in your backyard, <laughs> exactly. there are products out on the market that can boost your efforts, correct? Absolutely. You can make some good choices with what you decide to drink. Everybody has a busy schedule. Who yeah. has time to have these juiced and ready for them? Here are some other things that offer pomegranate in their juice form. There's the acai berry, which yeah. is known to be the highest content of antioxidants in the world mm. from South and Central America. America, and then there's other ways that you can get pomegranate in a, in a juice form. And you said the big key here is just to watch the amount of sugar. You want to just make sure that there's there's not too much sugar overloading all of this. Absolutely. You don't know for sure exactly how much of the antioxidants are in there. So you want to get something with a high percentage and not loading in with a lot of additives and sugar to make it defeat the purpose. And topically, there are things that you can do. I've always thought that maybe these products were just part of that whole fan and fad sort of thing. But you say that these actually work to help with the... Sure. Well, one of the big things is ultra, ultraviolet radiation, the sun sure. damage, indoor tanning, or even it's things like smoking, they damage your skin. So if you have something on top that's an antioxidant, it helps defend the skin. And then there's vitamins as well if you are having a hard time getting that smoothie in the morning. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and this can even give you some of resveratrol, which is one of our newer super antioxidants Ooh. that's said to be an antioxidant and tell the cells to live longer. If you want more information on antioxidants, uh, free radicals, Dr. Evans is a great lady, and there's more information there on her website, or you can link to it on ours, ktla.com. She's a local physician, of course.